Hi all and uh, welcome back to a small help video. Today we are going to talk about Google Maps and how to use Google Maps and especially if you are having issues not being able to locate uh, your own position or find your way through the city then I have some tips and tricks how to get this fixed. So let's get started and the next thing up is my always good advice if you have any issues with your ipad iphone then always do a restart of your device simply just up down on the volume button and then slide to the right and you turn off your device these are the two simple uh, things that you can do if you are having issues with google maps and not being able to find your location Let's try to go into Google Maps and in here you can see it is already saying that I don't have my location service turned on so Google Maps is not really able to locate anything right now. I say cancel OK and you can see it just simply finds somewhere else. This is not where I'm located right now so it's just simply going back to the states. So let's go into the settings and see how we can enable the location service into settings and in here we go down to the privacy and security and the first uh, thing up here is the location service and you can see it is off simply go into this one and make sure to turn it on so now my location service is turned on but this is probably not enough so I would definitely recommend you to go down into Google Maps settings, find Google Maps right here. So in here we have different settings and the first one is the location. And in here you have four different choices. You can say never, then you will definitely not be able to use the location service and Google Maps will still complain. So at least take the always then it's always on or only the one while using app this is the one i recommend you to always use and down here we have a precise location this is definitely also a good idea to have that enabled because then your google maps will be more precise with the location and being able to find your right way through the morning traffic so uh that was the location service. Then we have another setting that is also very important to have enabled. So if I go back into my general session setting, uh, section, and in here we have the background app refresh. Simply go into this one, and here you will have a long list of your apps that needs to sometimes use the background app refresh. And in here, I simply can find my Google Maps. And as you can see, it is actually turned off. So I will turn it on with the right one. And now it is enabled and will be able to run in the background. If you are in the traffic or whatever, then you will always be able to use Google Maps. If your app has been installed for several months or years back, then it is always a good idea to check for updates on the app. So simply go into your app store, go into search, go for the Google Maps, this one. So in here you can see different things and your Google Maps app will show up. And as you can see here, it is actually saying update. So I will definitely just push the button and it is now updating my Google Apps map uh, app in here. And as you can see, this is the way it looks like when it is updating, it is saying loading and then you can see how far it is and it will only take a few seconds before it is updated. And now I will have the latest fixes from Google and that could also be a good uh, solution for uh, apps not working as you expected to. So let's go into it again and see 
yes, it is actually able to locate right now. And hopefully this will give you a Google Maps uh, app that is working again and you will be able to find your way through the morning or afternoon traffic and get back home. I hope you liked this video and could uh, use some of the tips and tricks. If you like it, give me a thumbs up. If you like my channel and all the help videos I have, give me a subscribe on the channel. If you have any questions or comments, simply put it underneath this video and I will read it and get back to you if you have any questions. Thanks a lot and uh, see you soon. If you like my videos, then find my channel and simply subscribe to the channel and you will get a notification every time a new video is out there. Find all my previous videos about helping out with iPhone or iPad. And you can also find the community area where you can ask questions and chat with some of the other subscribers.